Hello there. Welcome to my reaction to One Piece set sneak peek. First look, Netflix geeked week. That's a mouthful. Um, I'm gonna say it immediately. If you haven't seen One Piece, don't watch this because I'm don't. I don't want to accidentally spoil something because I'm gonna look at the sets and just possibly say where they are in the show and even though it's the very beginning of the show still I might say what happens accidentally or something uh, I don't want to spoil anything for anybody who hasn't seen One Piece so go away for anyone else One Piece fans welcome aboard um, yeah I'm very excited for this thing I really really hope that Netflix are not gonna fuck it up like they normally do. I really, really, really hope. So far it seems fine. Let's take a look at sets. Like the actors that, that were chosen seem fine, seem totally totally fine. Uh the amount of episodes they take for the first season, which is a very short season still, is quite a big one. So I don't know how to feel about that. But yeah. We'll see. We'll see when it comes out. That will be much uh, better thing than just speculating. But you know what? Like, comment, subscribe, become a member. Let's see. Hello, everyone. I'm Yaki Godoy, and I play Luffy hey, in Luffy. One Piece. Hi, I'm Steve Maeda. I'm the showrunner of One Piece. And I'm Matt Owens, showrunner. And as you can see, we're here in South Africa bringing One Piece to life. Uh, we'd like to show you a sneak oh. peek of some of our massive sets. In South Africa. Biggest One Piece fan, it's been really exciting seeing some of my favorite places from the manga become a reality. All right, enough talk. Roll the clip! Roll it! Oda's world is so unique. Indeed. Seeing all of this stuff in person, being able to reach out and touch it is just been That's it. That's how fast such it is. an experience. Okay. Our crews down here in South Africa. That is... Well, it's not accurate, but fine. Africa are incredible. I'm fine with some changes. But right here. This whole concept art, though. And it's been so rewarding to see them taking Oda's world and bringing it to life. The fins... I think fins are already undone here, so... Because of the level there of detail go. and attention that goes into all of these sets, they take a good amount of time. Well, I mean, right now yeah. we're building Arlong's map room, and it's already been a couple of weeks, but it's a big build because it's a really important location. It a lot is. of drama goes down in there, a lot of action goes down in there, so we yeah. have to get it just right. Oh, fuck. Uh, seeing Luffy's and Arlong's fight in the show, I can't fucking wait. I don't care about Kuro. Don Krieg is fine. Uh, Morgan, that's the one. The axe hand. That's all fine, but Arlong is the first kind of villainous villain. And I can't wait. Oh, I want to see that so bad. Baratia looks I fine. The ships, but Baratia is massive. It is iconic it is surrounded by floating docks along with a bar inside the fish mouth which is going to be Zoro's favorite spot in those uh, episodes Zoro doesn't spend a lot of time on Baratia it didn't even have a bar in the show it was just a restaurant he just sat at the table and then quite fast action time. I, I guess there were, they did spend a, a bit of time there when Luffy was uh, working. Hmm. Okay, we'll see how that plays out in the show. At the end of it all, I'm most excited to just be able to share this world with old fans and new. We get to go to work every day the and walk these massive or whatever they and call. see these characters come to life. Alviga. It's a really special experience and a privilege, and we can't wait to share it with you. God damn, that's the smallest peak I've ever seen. Is that it? 
Minutes and new. We get to go to work every day and walk on these massive I mean, it was two minutes. I know what I was going to. What is that mirror? Life. It's a really special. That looks kind of familiar. Is that the ship they went from Variety on? When Nami went on her own, is that the ship? Can't remember. Or is it the first after Buggy? I don't know. Experience and a privilege. Windmills. Where are windmills? Were they in the Luffy's village? I can't fucking remember. Kind of hope the show stars like like manga did and not like the anime. So it shows the whole prequel immediately. And we can't wait to share it with you. Well, a bit underwhelming uh, because just two minutes, but overall it looks fine. I don't know why you would change things like the in even in the concept concept arts. Is that how the bird looked in the show? I don't remember. That's not... Like, the most iconic thing, the most iconic ship of all in this part of the story. Why did you change the head? Why did you make it more... I guess it is real, but... It wasn't necessary. Also, that Luffy's outfit is... a. Uh, or much later in the show. Is that the mountain they blew up? Testing the cannons. I don't know. I don't know. It, it looks fine, but I'll have to wait. I'm fine with going sets. Like letting sets be a, its own thing. Instead of copying its one to one from... The original, as long as everything else is great. Like the effects, the how Luffy's fighting, how that CG is gonna look like, how is Buggy gonna look like, how is anything gonna look like. I hope stuff like um, Fishman will not be CGI and will be practical. Because this could fall into Doctor Who hole, where when it's CGI it looks like garbage, but then practical it's fucking amazing. But when it's practical effect, like the makeup and stuff is what I meant. Again, just wait and see. My idea looks much taller, but not as wide as it did in the show. I think it was circular in the show, right? can't remember exactly. There's also a lighthouse. I guess it makes sense for the kind of a beam. Beam. Just kind of thing it is in the middle of the sea, a restaurant, so you can, you can make yourself known and stuff. But still. Is there anything else? Oh, the insides. Insides were remade. I remember there was like a spiral staircase up to the top, to the second floor. This like multi floor, two layers on each side, two set of stairs. Something weird over here, something weird over here. Showing broken ships. That's an interesting thing to show in your restaurant. But again, wait and see. All right, thank you for watching this uh, pointless short video. <laughs> I'm not talking about this, I'm talking about my own. Um, you know, thank anybody who watched this. I appreciate it a lot, and I hope to see you next time. Goodbye, have a great life because one of us has to.